the benefits come from having control of being able to kind of direct yourself between states. And think of it like, um, let's say you were going to hike a mountain. So training is you preparing to actually hike the mountain where boost is you taking a helicopter to the top and going, oh, OK, this is what this is the end state that I'm reaching for. But you don't know how to get there again. You see, okay. so boost is actually just shifting you and you're passive. You might be doing a meditation and you yeah. might, but you're going to get into a state that might last four to six hours. There will be some extra lingering benefit because we stimulated the mitochondria. There's other biomechanisms involved, but you don't necessarily know how to get into that theta state again by yourself. Whereas with training that biofeedback, you will learn. The boost could be like your pre-workout and then the, and then the <laughs> neurofeedback is like your, your gym time. That's exactly okay. right. So it allows for that stacking. Um, okay. And we guide what is well stacked together. And so with that boost primer, you are actually stimulating your mitochondria, you're stimulating your neuroplasticity before you go to train so that you actually learn faster. Okay.